When Korea first started sending their cars to Australia, many locals thought, well, they wouldn't last long. Let's face it, we all thought the Japanese and the Americans had the market sewn up. But over the years, the Korean imports have quietly chipped away, watching and learning and slowly taking over. And now they've thrown out an absolute scorching car that blends aggressive styling with performance and affordability and class. Say hello to the brand new Kia Cerato Coupe. When you factor in affordability and style, the Cerato Coupe is impressive. I like the way it looks. I like the fact that it's a coupe, so it's got two doors, which means less vertical lines, and it allows the horizontal lines to flow more smoothly. Tell you what, this is a head turner. Kia first brought the coupe to Australian shores in 2013, and it was their very first turbocharged model. It was also the most powerful car available on Aussie roads for under $30,000, and that made it very popular with drivers who wanted a little more grunt under the hood without the grunt in the bank account. So, does Kia's latest offering stand up to its competition? My opinion, it does. You see, when they first released the coupe, it was probably a little bit too aggressive. In the 2015 model, they've dialed back the aggression just a touch. Sure, it still looks great on the road, it's very eye-catching, but this time round, it gives you a great ride and a little bit of sophistication. While the Serato is available in a sedan and a hatch, it's the coupe which is the one you really want. And it's not just because it looks slick from the outside. Under the hood, there's a 1.6 litre turbocharged six-speed auto that will take you from zero to 100 in just over seven seconds. And it's also available in a six-speed manual, which is actually Australia's most powerful car under $30,000. You learn something new every day. This is in fact the same engine that you'll find in its cousin, the Hyundai Veloster. But it's what Kia have done with all the mechanical parts that support it that set the coupe apart. At the top of the list is the perfectly tuned steering and suspension that match our Australian road conditions perfectly. And when you put your foot down, you'll be surprised at the lack of steering torque you'd expect from that angry turbo. Come on, give me one happy smile. As a result, the handling is one of the most impressive features of the coupe. It's predictable and gives you confidence if you want to throw it into some tight turns. Combine that with the progressive automatic gearbox with the sporty paddle shifters and you find yourself with one very reassuring ride. Now, the inside of the coupe continues the sporty theme, helped by sporty seats, sporty steering wheel with these great paddles at the back so you can change through the gears, a dual analog digital display that's really easy to read, look-alike carbon fibre inserts, brushed aluminium pedals. Now, it looks fantastic, but above all, it's extremely comfortable. If you want features like satellite navigation, full leather interior, and dual zone climate control, you'll have to opt for the Touring Pack, which is a little bit extra. But either way, the coupe comes with push button start, Bluetooth with audio streaming, and LED dust sensing headlights as standard. Now, when it comes to a coupe, or coupe as some people like to say the word, most people will think impractical. Two doors and normally a small back seat. Well, those people, when it comes to the Serato Coupe, would be wrong because its rear seat offers you more space than you'd expect. And so too does the boot. 378 litres of unexpected boot space, to be exact. And that makes all the difference when compared to its compatriot, the Velosta. The coupe is more practical and more comfortable on long drives, with plenty of legroom and headroom. With a five-star ANCAP safety rating, the Kia Coupe is not just affordable, stylish, and a great drive, it's also extremely safe. You know, the entry-level performance car market in Australia is a very competitive one. Now, with the Kia Coupe, I believe you've got something that must be on your radar. So Colin, tell me, how has the new Coupe been received by buyers? Really well, Aaron. The new Kia Coupe has got European styling, it's got some really nice features. Also comes with great fuel economy, eight litres per 100 kilometres. And it also comes with great peace of mind, doesn't it? That's correct. It comes with a seven year factory warranty with roadside assistance as well. To get more information on the Kia Cerato Coupe, drop into Cannington Kia. You'll get a great price and great service because they're part of Australia's largest motoring group. 
AHG. Jump on to canningtoncare.com.au or follow the links from Zoom TV.